Well, on the last lap, we had to. We know we had to push because it was in P6. So on the when I saw there's one minute left, I just went for it and we got the third place. So that was good. But we knew we had the pace there throughout the whole session. But it's always good news to give that extra quick lap in on the last minute. Hopefully we'll get off the line this time and hopefully we'll do well and stay up there with the top ones and see how we get on. Uh, so I started off the day not so good. I, um, in FP1 I actually crashed on the fourth lap uh, in the wet so uh, I was sort of behind, I was at a disadvantage to everyone else. Uh, and in FP2 I you know, chipped away and then I got second in that one and then qualifying. Um, the qualifying actually isn't my strong point uh, so I was, I've been trying new things this year. Um, so I was at the back on my own, away from everyone else, and I was just chipping away, doing laps and laps. And then I finally improved in towards the end, and um, I was only point two away from uh, Thomas. So, uh, you know, I'm happy to be on the front row, and I'm looking forward to a good race tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, I, I really hope it's dry, because um, I was actually here last year as a wild card, um, and uh, I, I did a really good lap time, which was my personal best. So um, I really hope it's dry, because um, I love this track in the dry, not, not so much in the wet. Um, but yeah, hopefully I can just stay on tomorrow and get some points. Yeah, so I think the biggest thing is that this morning was really bad conditions. Um, the first session was really wet, uh, the same as what we had last time we were here. Second session was um, a bit risky because personally I would have gone on the slick tyres, which meant that you know we weren't able to push at the, the pace that I wanted to anyway, so we decided that it would be best, well, I decided it'd be best to just focus on things like my reference points around the track and just work on my position on the bike in different parts of the track so that I knew I could do a perfect lap, but I wasn't able to do the perfect lap in, in free practice. Well, t you know, tomorrow I'd like to win the race again. Um, I've, I've done it before, <laughs> so, you know, I think the biggest thing is to, to try and get away at the front and this time I'm starting from pole so it means that hopefully I'll be <laughs> able to get away a bit quicker on the start which would be nice but I'm looking forward to the race I know you know some of the other riders are have had a bit more experience with the bikes and they're a lot faster off the start and uh, hopefully there'll be a group of us.